friends, welcome back to Leap and ICSA Learning Channel. In my previous videos, we have seen the basic concepts of ratios and some problems related to it. In this video, I am going to solve more problems to understand the concept better. We have already seen that a ratio is a relationship between two quantities of the same kind or same unit. Always remember that a ratio must always be expressed in its lowest term. We, I have already told you a ratio is a different form of fraction. So if you multiply or divide a ratio by the same number then that ratio will not change. So let's see how to reduce ratios in its simplest form. Ratio in lowest term or simplest form. It should be keep in mind that a ratio must always be expressed in its lowest term. Simplify each of the following ratios. First one 20 is to 55. So 20 is to 55. In this type of problem, first you have to check whether the given number is a natural number or fractional number. If it is natural numbers, you have to find the HCF of the numbers and divide each term of the ratio by its HCF. So first here, we have to find the HCF of 20 and 55. HCF 20 and 55. Divided by 5 using prime factorization method 4 11. Then there is no other common factor, so HCF is 5. HCF is equal to 5. So now we divide each term of the ratio by HCF. So Simplest form or lowest term, simplest form equal to 20 is to 55, that is 20 by 5 is to 55 by 5. So this will become 4 is to 11. What do you mean by ratio in simplest form? If a ratio A is to B is said to be in its simplest form, each term has no common factor other than 1. Next one 56 is to 98. Working rule, first check whether the given numbers are natural numbers or fractional numbers. Here 56 is to 98, so they are natural numbers. So find HCF of numbers and divide each term by HCF. So 56, 98. We have to find the HCF. 56, 98. We are going to find the HCF by prime factorization method. So first we divide by 2. Then this will become 28. And this will become 49. Now 28 and 49. So we cannot divide by 2. We cannot divide by 3. We cannot divide by 5. So next prime number 7. So 7. So 7 4 are 28. 7 7 are 49. Now 4 and 7. They have no common factor. So HCF of 56 and 98 is 2 into 7. That is 14. HCF is equal to 2 into 7 which is, is equal to 14. Then lowest term ratio by 14. 56 by 14 
is to 98 divided by 14. 56 by 14. 14 fours are 56. So 4 is to 14 sevens are 98. So 4 is to 7. So next one 1 by 15 is to 1 by 25. So first we have to check whether the given numbers are natural numbers or fractional numbers. Here 1 by 15 and 1 by 25. So they are fractional numbers. So here we have to find the LCM of the denominators and multiply each term of the each term of the ratio by LCM. So here 15 and 25. 15, 25, LCM is equal to 5 into 3 into 5, which is equal to 75. Then lowest term, lowest term, we have to multiply each term of the ratio by LCM. So, 1 by 15 into 75 is to 1 by 25 into 75. So, this will become 5 is to 3. Keep on watching my channel. If you like this, Please subscribe and share it.